on Wednesday hosted a Spanish president, Petro Sanchez, who is on a two-day visit in the country. The two heads of state held talks on matters climate change, tourism, agriculture, water management and renewable energy. The two also reaffirmed their commitment on a stronger ties between the two countries. Sanchez is the first Spanish head of state to visit Kenya in 60 years. The renewal of the current financial protocol, Your Excellency, to be addressed by the two countries will add new funds to the kitty and facilitate the implementation of Kenya's priority projects by Spanish com uh, companies. And I have clearly stated, Your Excellency, that um, Kenya is open for business. We have created a bigger private public sector engagement enterprise that will work between the public sector in Kenya, the private sector in Kenya, and also your private sector to leverage on opportunities that can help our two countries grow. We have tremendous opportunity in the areas of the blue economy, where we know Spain has a lot of experience. We will open that those opportunities for our private sector, your private sector, and the public sector is going to play a facilitative role in ensuring that we tap into these opportunities for both economic development, creation of jobs, and adding value to the enormous resources that we have in our oceans and in our rivers. We are looking forward to learning experiences from Spain, and the European Union, you have walked this journey ahead of us, and we will look forward to learning from you how to consolidate our market and how to take it to the level of a federation. Because we are very strong believers that the future is that of cooperation, working together, and building a common market, not just as the East Africa community, but also as the continent of Africa using the infrastructure of Africa continental free trade area that Kenya is a signatory. And again, Spain can leverage on the advantage you get out of Kenya being the champion, not just for the East Africa community, but the Africa continental free trade area. The court has ruled in favor of the Internal Affairs Unit 